really Atlanta Track Club? Did you have to be that much of a disappointment to suspend, cancel, or whatever this year's Atlanta Marathon? Pretty much all because of funding, because lack of entrance for the race. That's pretty much saying that, oh yeah, people, we're, we're just pussies though. So we're just going to please everybody though. And we'll just do the 10 miler instead. Well, newsflash though, not everybody is going to want to do that though. I know you have alternatives, you know, try to like uh, make sure that, hey, you're going to get a refund back. But listen, some people don't want to do that. Some people would prefer just to run the Atlanta Marathon, you know. Just imagine being in their shoes. You've been training probably after last year's race. And you were so excited. You're like, man, I love it. I got to do it again. I can't wait for it. You register. You pay your fee. Then next thing you know, almost out of, uh, out of the blue, you cancel. Like, you, yeah, you're just going to say, oh, no, we're not going to run our, our race. How do you think that person feels, huh? I know you can't be fair with everybody, and the key to failure is trying to please everybody, and that's what they're trying to do, and guess what? This method is not working out at all, all right? If you want to cancel, like, a rate, like a marathon, like, to say you're not going to run it, the only reason I see in doing this is inclement weather. You know what happened in New York in 2012? Yeah. That was reasonable, alright? Not this. You know, if I was the, uh, the CEO or like the head chairman and I was going to make the decision, like the final call, you know what I would do? I would decrease the field, you know, for the marathon. Instead of having like a six hour time limit, why not three hours? Sub three, though. So it'll be short, quick, easy, though. The cops? You know, traffic, it'd be over and done with, though. One section each, you know, when you start at Atlantic Station, and you pretty much go all the way around the perimeter, like, outside. You know? After each is bu buddy has, has passed, all, all the runners have passed, okay, traffic will be back to normal, you know? Doesn't take that much money. Doesn't take that much time. Why not do that alternative, though? You know? It's pretty much a slap in the face for anybody who wants to challenge themselves, though. But having this, oh, more people want to do the 10 miler and stuff, and we got positive responses and all that. Okay, that's great. You could include that, which you did last year, but you could still include the marathon. Alright? But it could just be shorter, though, because those are the extremists, though, the runners. They like to do that, you know. If they're not going to have any kind of really extreme ultra marathon, go with a shorter field, but that's much more competitive, though. Just don't be like, oh, psh, cancel it when, a when people already have, you know, registered for it. I know, yeah, they'll get, they'll get a refund and they have alternative to do any other events, but why did the Atlanta Track Club have to do that? I just, I, to me, personally, though, it was a dick move by them. That's, that's, that's just my opinion, though. Yes, I am taking this seriously, and I shouldn't be, but I'm very passionate about something like this, and the fact that I was going to register for that marathon in October, but now I can no, I can't, though. Because it was, th I was thinking, you know, right after I went to Peace Tree, all right, I can incorporate more marathon base training, in August and September, and then cut back, okay, well, like, uh, mid-September, and then cut back a little bit, and then get ready for, for the marathon in October, though. No, nah, can't do that anymore. If anybody says I need to take it easy about being you know, too serious, well, guess what? It's my nature and passionate kind of person, though. So if you don't like it, too, guess what? Too bad, because I don't give a fuck. I honestly don't think the track club deserves, like, anyone's money. Like, not my money, though. The only race I would I would fund for them that they're hosting is the uh, Peachtree Road Race, so that's it. Any other race, uh, probably not. You know, after doing that, no, no. Unless there could be some really convincing going on in the next few weeks or months. Other than that, I 
I don't, I don't, I don't think I'll run another uh, race that's hosted by the Atlanta Track Club other than the Peachtree. Unless somebody else hosts the Peachtree, that'll be better. But if uh, they don't do something right, then I no, it's just it's just not gonna work out though. Maybe I might change my money in a couple years or so, but now I'm 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 upset with them, very upset. That's all I gotta say though. And you know what? I hope they do better. I really do. It's very disappointing.